Yo bro, so today I want to teach you something that I've learned recently. I learned it from Hamza and I learned it from a number entrepreneur called Sam Ovens and it's called Essentialism and I think Sam Ovens called it uh, Death by a Thousand Cuts. So I'll teach you in a second. Give me one second. Um, let me just let me just get my iPad. Three, two, one, go. Alright, cool. So what they're essentially talking about is throughout the day we tend to do so many like mini tasks or throughout our life or whatever stage we are in life we tend to do so many things so let's just say one second so let's call this essentialism so right now our life might have like let's say school um work gym um cooking um let's say uh would you call it let's say you're doing some religious work religion um you might have like i don't know um like family friends um then you have like these small tasks like let's say football um you might have i don't know some game that you're playing let's say league of legends i don't know whatever game you play so can you see like you've got so many things on your plate basically and what happens is we can't tend to make any progress because our attention is going to so many directions so what uh, Hamza was teaching or Sam Oven teaches is for a period of your life you want to have one second you want to have something like this maybe so let's just say family um let's say religion and you want to make you know what you want to make this line even bigger so work all the way up up here so what it means is that for a little bit you want to spend like for let's say i don't know the next six months or something like that you want to spend time obviously with your family you might have to sacrifice some time or um let's say with your religion you might want to like i don't know um cut down on certain things that you do every day just to make progress in your workplace so so that when you make more progress in your work you can go back and make progress in like religion and family and the reason i'm making this video is because um lately oh sorry lately i've been um I don't know wasting a lot of time like going to the gym because if you think about it the gym i don't just spend like one hour just working out it's not just the one hour before the one hour workout so let's see workout here before the one hour workout is like getting ready um meals um picking up my friend uh friend um I don't know we might uh what do you call it we might even eat something together i don't know eat um after the workout we'll chew in the car talk um another meal um uh, whilst we do maybe go to the shops do you see like when everything comes together it's actually like three hours we're spending or maybe even more i was spending probably even more so i just told my friend like bro you know what um i feel like i, I need to stop going to the gym for a while obviously i want to make the progress but i don't think that's the area that i want to make for, um progress in right now i'm not like the biggest guy or i'm not like the skinniest guy either i've made decent progress in the gym i've been training for five years so i know how to train i know what to train i know like how to bulk and stuff like that and i'll say i'm in decent physique as well so I just told him bro sorry for a while i'm not gonna come to the gym and he was okay with it like we get along quite well and he was like bro just focus on what you need to focus on and i told him like if i need to make gym content then i'll come and like record in the gym that's me coming for work not for like training and what i'll do is at home i'll just train with the weights that i've got from my older brother and yeah like i don't know if you if you guys have ever seen like andrew tay and them lot like just working like they'll be on their laptop and then they'll do like 20 sets or um sorry 20 reps of like shoulder press or something like that i've seen them do that quite a, um 
for some time now and i always wondered why is that because um i don't know i just found it a bit weird at first but then now i sort of get it like they don't really want to waste time going out to the gym getting ready and whatnot there was a lot of like time wasted during that time um so yeah i just made that decision i said if i need to make gym content i'll go to the gym if i don't then i'll be at home i'll just train there and yeah i'll just get some more work done so that's the approach that i'm starting to take now um at first i was like yo this is like bizarre this is a different not a level but th the reason i get it is because when i was making progress in the gym it was because there was nothing else in my life that was going on like as in like big basically so it was just going to going to sixth form um working and going gym and that's why i made a lot of uh, progress and obviously after sixth form i went to uni so it was just education work and um gym and i never really thought about business ideas and stuff like that i was never into it like that before but um now that i've gone into it i know like how much time um obviously goes into business and how much you have to learn and there's a lot to learn so i'm like you know i've made decent progress in the gym um do i need to be hitting it like five six days a week anymore um not really to be honest and it's not from an egotistical point of view like i said i'm not the biggest guy but um it's come to a point now where you know what i'm in decent shape i can keep this physique is maintainable and i can try and make more progress in like my business basically and it works well because when i start maybe like my bus driving job i might not get that much time and um that way that like, i'm sort of like preparing myself for for those days basically and when i do start bus driving i might just be able to work out two three times a week and i might just do that and the rest of the days i'm just working on like business and just trying to make money basically basically right now i'm in a phase of my life where i'm just trying to basically make money and um i sort of tried doing this before but um i just uh, i just couldn't I, I didn't really understand the concept or i wasn't really sure how to implement it so yeah um hopefully you learned something man um and yeah if you feel like this is the right move for you i suggest you sh like like try it out give it a go see if it works for you obviously i've done fasting now i told you guys how good fasting has been cold showers are really good as well and um now i'm trying this new uh, technique out as well um yeah obviously uh, certain things don't work with everyone but why not just give it a go and see if it works for you so yeah man that's all i've got for today and i'll catch you guys tomorrow